What's up, everybody? Cats007, and today we are playing Thief. You know the vibes. You know, back in the day, we used to kite number one hunters like it's our day job. And hope you all heard that Thief got a buff, and you know, he has some new abilities that's really cool. I'm like, you know what? Let's check in and play it out. You know, when it comes to playing Thief, he is a very, very, very technical character and very hard to master. You have to master the distance, the discipline, maintaining your ground with the flashlight. You know what I'm saying? So there's some instances where you got to run away from the hunter. There's some instances where you got to get close up into his face like you got beef with that hunter. You feel me? So now we're getting into it. Hunter's coming after me. So look, I got to make sure he can't use his line. So I'm making sure my flash is constantly on him. Oh, oh and I get the stun of justice maintaining my distance now look he gets like a little ground flash check this out put it down it's like another flashlight and it stops his abilities right and then it can add on to the regular flash i have in my hand yo this ability is so far so like i'm gonna run back into him watch this run back avoid the lines maybe bait him out a little bit maintaining that distance on and off with the flash like i said very very technical so now I'm maintaining my distance, trying to get back close in, you know, trying to um, take off his abilities. Watch that, going back and forth, back and forth. Um, gotta get close, trying to get another stun in here. Can I get it? Boop, get that stun. As soon as I get a stun, I'm out, maintaining my distance. And yo, he's one of these who you can stay in the open with. Ooh, canceling the ability, Lord Jesus. Please stop this man. This man is on crack cocaine. Gorgeous. And I take the hit here, but here's the thing. I ain't got no more flashlight, bro. I got a little flashlight on the ground, though. Check this out. He can't even throw his note. And I always get stunned here. Like, like, it stays up for 40 seconds. Like, yo, you can do a really good loop if he doesn't break it. You know what I'm saying? So I really want to start utilizing this more. Like, I started playing Thief just for one session. I'm doing this within one session. So if I can get better with like the flashlights and looping back to it, like let's say I left it right in that um, place on the bottom of the hospital and I loop back to it. And if he doesn't destroy it, he's gonna run back into the whole thing again. Like he can make looping extremely good. I end up running into this line here and I'm getting basement, bop. But am I gonna get basement though? I don't think so. Cause we got a plague, Lord Jesus, with the forward of justice. Hey, listen, I know. <laughs> Nobody trusts nobody trusts plagues forward and I think it's known throughout the community. We don't trust plagues forward You see him play forward. He's definitely throwing your match, but look at this Slow reaction time, but he's putting in the work Lord Jesus. He is doing the Lord's work Yeah, he said listen cats cats. I may be a garbage forward, but I got you now He's trying look. He's not doing so bad. He's not his reaction time can be a lot faster It'd be nice to get those little instant stuns in but He's doing his best. He's doing his best here. Go for another pickup and plague with the stun of justice. Lord Jesus, this man is too good at this game. This man does not deserve to be here. He needs to be on a professional level. IVL, IVC, whatever you call it. Koa 5. Look at that stun all oh, right into the wall. My God, this man is broken. Yo, look. Can he hit? Can he stun the hunter on chair? He might even hit that chair. He's gonna stun the chair. What are you gonna do? Can he stun the hunter? Oh, he actually got the hunter. Yo, he actually got the hunter. I'm so surprised. Like, if that was plague, bro, he would have probably stunned that chest that's in the middle of it. Ooh, dodging back and forth. You are not touching me, violin. It's hitting me at the bottom of basement, right? So plague popped off, bro. Plague popped off. Yo, he did his thing. I did my thing. All right, he's gone. I'm kiting. And now he should have went to the other gate. This, this, this is where the game kind of threw, you know? So, I'm doing my thing, kiting. I don't know why he went to this gate. Plague is absolutely broken, so I'm kiting. I'm like, okay, I can't go to ruins. He's going to line me. So, I need to, like, abuse a pallet or something. But these notes, like, this violin is actually at every single one of these notes. Like, you see, with Thief, it's a whole different play style, so you don't really know how to adjust him. But with those notes, hitting those accurate notes, like, the well, first ability, that's pretty smart, pretty good. But the Vio brought an up build. And if you saw... So he's breaking pallets really fast. And I saw he's like, oh, it's an up the vial, no blink, maybe. So he probably has Telly. So he's going after Plague. No one is across the map to save me. This is looking like a three-man escape. If Plague can get off in time, he's end up teleporting, throwing the notes, throwing the notes. Hopefully someone get back to me. He needs to get to dungeon. I'm dying on chair. I'm running tied on thief, so I shouldn't be dying that slow. Uh Plague almost running to the hunter. Um trying to do the best he can. Almost gets hit here. Everyone's trying to leave. I'm still on chair. 
Um, he should have went into hospital to wait it out, but we're coming to the end of the video. I hope y'all enjoyed. I'm Catch the Bull 7, and I'll catch y'all later. Peace.